Hey everybody, I'm Gabby and this is RVs with Gabby. If you are into camping and traveling, if you love RV life too, RVs with Gabby is the right channel for you. Hey everybody, welcome back to RVs with Gabby. Thank you so much for watching my channel. If you love my content, please don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notification bell so you never miss another walk around video. All right, so we're here. It is another feature and benefit Friday. I know everybody's loving these. Now, some of them are like, hey Gabby, I know I'd like a black tank flush. What was that about? Um, Listen, some people, they're early on in their process compared to others, so I wanna make sure that I hit all of the features and all of the benefits that you could possibly find on, on an RV and you know some things to think about when you're looking for your next one. So right now I'm standing in front of the Jayco Jayfeather Micro. As you can see, I've got my tripod here, so this is all being done on my own. I don't have my camera person today. Unfortunately, what ended up happening was she went home for the day honestly. She went home for the day after I was done with my customers. They're actually signing on this unit right here. This is a nice 2023 199 MBS. Super excited for Sophia and Danny. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, maybe you'll see this video and you'll be like, hey, that's our camper. So this is what we're going to talk about for FMB Friday today, guys. Let's see if I can get a better view of the sticker. You see that sticker there that says Asdell? Probably I will overlay a close-up of that sticker and some more informational like graphics on that because it'll be easier for you to to look at that and see what what the heck is Asdel, Gabby? What are we what are we talking about today? All right. So normally on these units that are vacuum bonded or pinch rolled, whatever laminated, whatever lamination process these guys use for their RVs, they have what's called Luon. It's the backer that the fiberglass sticks to, adheres to, right? So normally years ago, uh, everybody was using what's called Luon, which is pretty much a very thin piece of wood, um, very, very thin. And when water gets in there, that's what causes that bubbling, that delamination, that appearance of like a faded, um, you know, bubble on the side of these fiberglass units. Keep in mind that not all fiberglass siding means that it's aluminum frame. So I am talking about laminated aluminum frame fiberglass campers. Okay. So anyway, back to Luan. Luan is a tiny little thin slice of wood that goes in the middle of this sidewall. And that's what it adheres the fiberglass to it. And I always say vacuum bonded lamination like Rockwood and Jayco do is way better than your pinch roll system. It's like your five-year-old uh, when they glue something to a piece of paper, right? If they just glue it and that's it, it's going to start to peel at the corners, right? So what do you do? You glue it and then you put a textbook on it and you weigh it down. Okay, that's exactly what they do in a vacuum bonded lamination process, but I'm not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about Asdel, which is the new non-organic composite material that they've built for to go inside these sidewalls to replace the Luon. Now, Asdel is huge in the industry right now. Everybody's talking about it. Everybody wants it in their in their laminated sidewalls. Why? What's the benefit to you as a customer? What does that mean when I say non-organic material, right? I'm just using big words. Truth be told, guys, this material, because it's not made of wood, okay, it's almost like a plastic. It's like a, um, a manufactured plastic. So it's got mildew resistant, mold resistant, water resistant. Practically nothing can penetrate this because it's not a wood. It can't absorb it. So what's awesome about that is that when you put Asdel in this sidewall, even if you didn't maintain your roof and that would be your, you know, for whatever reason, you got a leak in your roof and that water traveled down this sidewall in an ideal world or actually ideally with this Asdel, there's nothing for that water to absorb into. So it would just travel all the way down through the camper and like honestly leak out the bottom. So that is the benefit of the Asdel in the sidewalls. Everybody's looking for it. Everybody wants it. Keep in mind that the original Asdel that came out a couple of years ago, Jayco had not put it in their units until like last year, two years ago maybe. And people were asking me, hey, like Rockwood's been doing it for several years or this manufacturer has been doing it for several years. Why hasn't Jayco caught on? Why aren't they doing Asdel in their motorhomes? That kind of thing. Their vacuum bonding lamination process is super strong. Okay, it's 144 tons of pressure for 16 minutes, I believe it is. So the thing is, 
that Asdell originally couldn't handle that vacuum bonded process. Like as soon as they put it in the big bag to vacuum seal it, it would break, right? And that's, and then you get these like weird lines going down the sidewall. So that is why they took a couple of years longer to do something. Um, it's the same thing with like Airstream, you know, some of the features that they, they, they put on the units, like other people were using sooner, but that's because they were, they want to test everything out. They want to make sure that everything is good to go before they give it their final stamp of approval, right? Cause when it first comes out, there's going to be some some kinks to work out in things. So a uh, company like Jayco, they want to make sure that they're doing everything right. They would rather um, they would rather you be frustrated that it hasn't come out yet than have the technology in the in the camper and it doesn't do what it's supposed to do, right? Or it, it frustrates you as a consumer and then it's like, why did you even put it in there? Because you didn't do your proper research. So that's pretty much it on the Asdell and the sidewall. It is a great benefit to some customers. Keep in mind, if you're looking at a travel trailer that is a wood frame with the corrugated aluminum siding like this, if you're looking at a wood frame with corrugated aluminum siding, you don't have to worry about that Asdell because that's not gonna be in that kind of unit. When you get that corrugated siding, that's not anything that is gonna adhere to that kind of Luon. Like that's a wood framed unit on its own. So it's gonna be a different beast entirely. But if you're looking at an aluminum framed fiberglass sidewall laminated unit, definitely the Asdell is a great feature to look for and it's got a big benefit to you as a customer. That's all I've got for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching my channel. And until next time, happy camping. Oh, and do me a favor and comment down below what else you'd like to see for Feature and Benefit Friday. Is there something that you have to have in your next motorhome or travel trailer or fifth wheel that you don't have now that you think I should cover for everybody else? Take care.